Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm going to go ahead and update Hex Coin since it's a highly requested coin. Um, here's the deal, guys, with Hex. Okay, so I'll give you a patient waiting game, but there's an alternative that could be going on here with Hex, possibly. Um, but he, the situation with Hex is this way right here. I've looked at that wave. That's a five wave move. So somewhere along the lines, Hex needs to make another move. And it didn't take very long. It only took it 40 days to make that wave. It was only 40 days. So somewhere over here, whatever it decides to do, it needs to make another wave. So the the uh, the issue right now with Hex is one, two, and you can maybe say that's a three. Um, it's not very deep, and it's coming up for a four and then back down for a five. And that's a possibility. So they, it would be like this. Okay, this is one possible. Here's your one, two, three, up for a four, and then down for a five. And maybe it's going to do an ending diagonal. So where it would be short, it could come, uh, it could be short. So one, two, and then three, like so. And then the four goes up into the price territory that way, one, and it comes down into a five. It could do something like that. That's a possibility. Um, and then it might not make these targets down here uh 0.01 cents okay now the other thing that is interesting i was looking at this is the uh the time it's taking a lot of time it's hanging down here burning up the time and there's a possibility it might still be in a b wave guys okay so what i mean is that you could have a five and then three three five and it's coming over here to make a b so you might have a move over here so people are asking me about getting in hex. They got in hex over here. So you might have a trade actually with hex right here. So it'd be one, two, three, and you got one, two, three, and it could go up into a B wave like that or a C wave, excuse me. And then it'll finally get around to making that wave over here to complete the uh, C wave. Just want to give you guys that heads up. That's something, don't count on it being that high, but just as an example, it could do that. And uh, just looking at the fibs, that it's doing, it's set up for that too. I was just, I'm like, what is it doing? It's taking up too much time. So if you take a uh, a retrace on this um, right here to the top of this three wave, I go here, look at that, 1.05. It hit 1.05. It might be blasting off into a C wave to make a massive B wave, guys. So what it could be doing, just to go over it again, here's your five, so A, B, C, which would be your your B wave, potentially, because it broke the low, so you know it's more than likely not going bullish. A, B, C, and then here with hex, it could be doing this. I'll put the lines on there. A, B, and then back down for C like that. It's just taking burning up the time. But this C wave could be aggressive, guys. It could be very aggressive since it's a flat. So a three, three, and this will be a five, and you want to be careful in here too. If it does do this, a one, two, three, four, five, this will suck a lot of people in. I can assure you lots of people will get sucked into this. They'll think it's gone bullish if it does do that. Just to give you an FYI, only to swing back around into uh, this five wave over here, okay? Because it's going to need this over here. If it does do that move, guys, it's going to need this A, B, and then back down for a C. Okay, so you have all two alternatives that I'd be looking at with hex. Could be doing an ending diagonal possibility. We will see uh, what it gets up to, and then it might fall short of that target. And uh, if it is an ending diagonal, it could take up more time, like it is doing right now. Um, but that fourth wave, you really want to see it get up to probably almost like four cents right here. You want to see it get four or five cents, and then your diagonal will be like that. So this is your alternative. You know, like a one two three four five and the reason i say that it seems like it did do a wave in there you can get a wave in there like you know kind of like that you see it's like three wave ish this is kind of it could be three wave ish so on an ending diagonal they need to be zigzag so three wave ish up three wave ish back up for a fourth into this price territory and a three wave back down like so and that could be the uh the end of it for hex and the alternative is a three three five flat and that flat that flat will blast if that becomes a flat, a three, three, five. They blast off pretty good. You and usually to the upside too. When, when it's bearish and they when the flats want to go up, they blast off. All right, guys, that's the end of my uh, video update on hex. If you made it all the way to the end, drop a like, hit the subscribe button. Peace.